the high-profile fraud case of sitting parliamentarian and former executive chairman of the Warden Sewage Corporation, Adrian Gibson, taking another twist following the arraignment of a fellow accused, Tanya Demerit, who's listed as a director of Elite Maintenance, the company at the center of Gibson's legal woes. Demerit, who was formally charged before senior magistrate Carolyn Vogue Evans this afternoon, is accused of offering and conspiring with others to induce a public servant, namely Gibson, to procure and execute Capital Works contracts for landscaping and maintenance. An audit and subsequent investigation found that Elite was awarded over $100,000 in contracts. Demerit's 16 counts ranging from conspiracy to commit bribery to bribery to fraud to fraud by false pretenses to money laundering acquisition. The Golden Gates resident pleaded guilty to all. She has, however, entered a plea agreement. As per that deal, Demerit is to give a written statement as to her role in the offenses. And as the director of elite maintenance, she must also testify under oath in the Supreme Court. She's also been placed on a three-year probation. Now, should Demerit fail to be of good behavior, she will be sentenced to two years at the Bahamas Department of Corrections. Further, as compensation, she must pay $10,000 to the WSC on or before July 29th. When asked if she was forced, coerced, or made any promise to enter the plea deal, Demerit said she was not. Demerit is represented by attorney David Cash.